guys, it's me and I'm back for another YouTube video and today is um, a video that I haven't done in a what type of video I haven't done in a while because today um, I'm giving you guys some tours through some of my sketchbooks. Not only will I be giving you a tour of sketchbooks 2 and 3, this one's unfinished and it will remain that way. This is completely finished. Not only will I be showing you sketchbooks two and three, but I will also be sharing with you guys my year eight and year nine sketchbooks from high school. Um, because I just recently found those when I was going through my room and I was like, yeah, I've got to show the world these. Um, and we'll, yeah, we'll start with the years, year eight and year nine. Um, sketchbooks because I have a feeling they're going to be pretty bad and then we'll go from there and we'll go from to sketchbook number two and number three so let's get to it I guess first of all I apologize if this angle is terrible but um yeah let's get to it let's put these two sketchbooks aside and start with year eight second year of high school e Oh, architecture. Oh, look at that. Terrible, terrible house. Yep, mind map. Oh, shell. That's actually not that bad. Um, I actually kind of like that. That's pretty cool. Um, different architectures. The Disney castle. Disney and Paris castle in it. Um, is this tone and texture? Yeah, that's... Whatever that is, designing a building. Yeah, that's... Okay, perspective. One point perspective. Okay, that's... This is bad, I'm sorry. Yeah. Um, Christmassy stuff. In January... We'll just have a look at that. Christmas stuff. In January... <laughs> This is 2017. Yeah. Oh, that's fun. Islamic tile design. Um. Don't know what I was thinking. I was using crayons. Like those, like, twisty pencil crayon things. Yeah. That's kind of nice. Patterny stuff. I remember being proud of that for some reason. I don't know. That's pretty cute. Um, oh, what's this? Can you tell I was only watching Jack Septica at the time? Um, watercolor star. I'm still pretty proud of that. Okay, this is where we got to do our own thing at like the end of the year. Um, and we were just giving random pictures, so I drew Astro Boy in this dude. I don't know who it is, I don't watch that anime. And then I drew the pre Reaper and Tracer. And then a human lightning queen for no reason. Yep, that's it, gear right. Done, so bye bye. Um This is where it gets good. This is year nine. So identity Peep the gayness. Um, this is where I start to improve my art. So this isn't hand. I can't draw hands for the life of me. The person I made up... I don't know, kind of looks like somebody on TikTok. Um, it's the person I was seeing opposite. It's me mum. It's me mum. Look how I drew the noses. Um, Van Gogh research. Colour wheels, because Miss kept having a go at the class because people didn't know how colours worked. That's fun. Um, oh, Roa, I love this. Okay, so this is a self-portrait in the style of Roa. He draws, like, decaying stuff. Look. In the dome! So, yeah, I did that. Um, Roy Lichtenstein. Pop artwork. Designing with, I don't ha I don't know what any of this had to do with what we were doing in year nine. But eyes in chalk royal pastels. 
caricatures of me and Benedict Cumberbatch, you can tell I was going through my Sherlock phase because, boom, Sherlock Holmes in the style of Picasso. There's a self portrait, I guess. Um, and a plan. I have that actual thing. So that's the plan. And if I. This is the actual thing. Let me. Hide the camera. So. Yeah. Plan, real thing. That looks more like him. Um, it's my form tutor who left at the end of year nine. So I've got a new one in year 10. But, um, yeah. I meant to give that to him before he left, but I forgot to do that when I drew a motorbike. And you don't want to see the other things that are in here. Like these people, you just don't want to see that. Let's go to sketchbook two. Um, yeah, not much to see here. Started on that date. 4th of September 2018, never actually properly finished it. So let's go. Um, yeah, the confusing pictures on Pinterest. I just copied somebody else's artwork there because I liked it. And I tried to imitate their style, but it didn't work. That's all right, I guess. I'm pretty proud of that. Still. Oh my God, my Jensen Ackles. Okay, I am still immensely really proud of how this turned out. I literally did this. Like, look, I did it the 30th of December 2018. Uh, that's after I do went to see Solo. And I started playing Detroit Become Human. There's Connor. Oh, and there's, um, yeah. Tic Tac, Page and Boss, and Barry by that artist. I was watching a lot of her YouTube videos then. We've got a Virgil. Got a lot of panic stuff, and then these cute birds. I can't remember their names are. I called them my little greens because I the stuff in like the checkered paper is um, when we were on holiday in Spain, and I wanted somewhere to sketch. So, then my mom Miranda, Ned, look at my little Ned. Uh, my trippy drawers inspired, but look at Ned. I'm still really proud of this as well. This is when I started using the grid method. This is Steve Harrington from Stranger Things. Another Steve in a caricaturesque style. That's when I first got my alcohol markers. It's a digital piece and there's Steve's stuff. Um, really bad drawing of Matt Pat from Escape the Night. Um, that's made to be Jake Portman from his program's Home for Peculiar Children. I think it looks good. I, know, I need to kind of revert back to that art style. I miss it. Um, random sketches. Stitch made of washi tape. Robert, uh, this is literally just a picture of Robert Downey Jr. with acrylic paint on top of it because that's what my art teacher wanted me to do in year 10 for my GCSE and I kept the actual things and I need to put pictures in the exam paper in my um, book. Just one line drawings. Tom Hiddleston done the exact same way as uh, Robert Downey Jr. was. Practicing of hands because God knows I need that practice. Um, set it off stuff. Remember this. I'm telling you, you need to remember the killer in the mirror drawing. Trust me. <laughs> ah, yes, my Brendan Yuri. I, I'm sad I'm unable to finish this, but I might redo it another time. Uh, my Marvel digital pieces. Um, I didn't even do those on my iPad. I did those on my Kindle. That's my hamster chaos. Try to draw her. Ignore that page, as far as I tried to do Inktober and it just didn't work. That's how far until October I got up. Until I gave up. Like, I did day eight. And that's it. Like, I did nothing else. And that's it for the sketchbook. Like, my pages. See, unfinished. Never going to be finished. This, however, this is sketchbook three. Started on the 2nd of November 2019. Finished on the 18th of April 2020. And it's got Alistair from Hasbin Hotel in the front. Yes, I drew him myself. And we open up with Shane Dawson. Now, I want to add that a lot of stuff done in here was me filling up like a page with acrylic marker drawings because I wanted to make sure I knew how to use them properly. So this is Shane. Um, I'm still pretty proud of how that one came out. Well done, me. 
as 2D, just a page of 2D. Good board. Um, junk rat and wrecking ball from Overwatch. I drew um, this is Jazz's drawing. I just drew it in my kind of style. Um, this is what I'm talking about. So this is yep, one of many Animal Crossing drawings I did. So you've got Tom Tommy and Timmy? Timmy Tom Timmy Tommy? I can't remember which way around they go. Um this was my yeah, that that was just from the news, but this is my own design. So I took a switch and then I took somebody else's drawing and took inspiration and just turned it into one big thing. I did a Polaroid, one of the boys. I did a dinosaur, because I didn't know what to draw, so I just drew a dinosaur. I drew Marceline Finn, Jake, and Bimo from Adventure Time. Okay, I really like this. I drew um, Sam, Dean, and Cass in the styles of Gravity Falls, and I really like how this came out. Um, I used Mabel as a base for um, Cass and the other two are dippers. Just need some Pokemon. A really bad Bell Cipher. A meme. This got noticed by the original artist, and as you can tell, his scales are actually great, uh, shiny. So, if, I don't know, you might have been advertised it on like YouTube or something, but there's um, this app called Webtoon, and there is a story on it, a comic on it, called Castle Swimmer, and I love it so much. Um, so I drew this when I finished, like, the first season, I guess, of Siren and Kappa. And the artist actually liked it and retweeted it on her Twitter, so yee. That's something I had to do for school. It's a cute plush glitch trap. I think he's adorable. Uh, a bendy, half and half. A lot of this is me just being bored. I followed um, this. I followed one of the Disney Parks YouTube tutorial videos on how to draw. And Stitch is my favorite character, so I drew Stitch. I redrew something um, in my own style that I found on Pinterest. Twenty One Pirates is sometimes quite as violent. Um, a Stitch. This is I love so much, and I'm sad because this was originally on my Red Bubble. But it got copyrighted because it's Stitch. But it's Stitch dressed as Dean. But you can, as from the end of this week, no? As from now, I think, yeah. Uh, you can get this as a print on my Etsy store, which will links down below. I drew Perry the Platypus. Um, this is the drawing I told you to remember about. Uh, so I redrew it. Including the lyrics, there's nobody but me here, the killer in the mirror. Mirror. I can't speak English. The show. I saw this picture on Pinterest and somebody put a plush shark in a washing machine. So I drew it. I drew. Um, again, this is something a lot of people do. Dean, Cass, and Sam. I drew some of Melanie Martinez's ha tattoos. Because they're really cute. I love them. And there's an otter. So, I mean, not a lot of these have, like, much meaning. That's why we're going through them so quickly. It's a squip. Like, it's the outside of the squip, and that's what the inside looks like. I don't know. My brain wasn't working. I don't know. I, I had a huge art block, and I just did what first came to mind. I followed another tutorial, and I drew a baby dory. I drew a baby dory. Um, you see, I got art block. I just drew the Shane Dawson logo. I got pathetic. Um, that's it. That is it. So we've got um, my two last sketchbooks and my year eight and year nine sketchbooks. Um, let me know in the comments down below. Do you want me to um, show you guys my um, unfinished GCSE sketchbook that we got to take home because we were nowhere near finished to send it in. Um, there's quite a cool, few cool stuff in there that I really like so I might show you guys that. Um, 
in the i card above i will also link my previous sketchbook tour i think from last year um no the year before that 2018 yep yeah it was the sketchbook before this one sketchbook number one but yeah i'll make a playlist in that and we'll start documenting my sketchbooks because i really love keeping track and I've got another one on the go currently, but I won't give you any sneak peeks, um, but yeah, so I hope you enjoyed the look through four sketchbooks and seeing the improvement, maybe not, of my art style. Thank you guys so much for watching this video, it means a lot to me, as always, if you liked it, attack that like button with your likes and don't forget to comment down below. What's your favourite st type of art style? Do you like more realistic? Do you like more anime cartoony style? Let me know in the comment section down below. Also, what do you prefer? Digital or traditional art? Currently, I'm doing both, as you can see on the channel. Um, but yeah, also comment down below if you'd like to see any more art related videos from me because I would love to do some like arts and crafts videos on the channel but I don't want to do them if people don't want to see that kind of content. Uh, once again thank you guys so much for watching this video, um, don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below if you haven't already and click the notification bell next to it to get notified every time I upload a new video which is every Monday and Friday. Thank you guys so much for watching this video, I love you all so much, stay safe. But you don't care, you're unaware Keep moving like the scars aren't even there It's in the air like a blazing flare